This is your girl, Eating with Food for Thought, <coughs> aka the personal chef. And I'm always coming from behind the camera. <coughs> and this morning, I would like to talk about the vinegar, <laughs> the apple cider vinegar detox drink. As you know, we're off into the seven day apple cider vinegar cleanse. And for me, today is day three. But I kind of do things a little bit different. I do what works for me. And this right here is my detox tea that I make up from loose teas. And so this is how I'm going to do this. Because I love mixing stuff together. And this is a good combination for me along with the apple cider vinegar. And this also is full of lemons and ginger. And this is how I like it over here. And you can see the loose teas in here. And I'm also going to add a half a teaspoon of ginger, half a teaspoon of turmeric, a fourth of a teaspoon of cayenne pepper. I buy things in bulk, so this is what I store it in. My cayenne pepper. These jars right here, <coughs> these water jars or um, boss and if you guys ever buy this type of water don't throw these away they are so handy for so many different things and right here what I'm drinking here this is my um, water but it's full of lemons so that's my lemon water okay I'm going to put a scoop of zeal I don't know if you guys have ever heard of this product, but this is a really good product right here. Google it. See what they're talking about on Zeal. I'm going to do a video on this, but right now, if you just want information right now, you're going to have to Google it, but this stuff is really, really good, and it comes in all types of flavors. Today, I'm using the wild berry. So I'm going to put a scoop of that in here. And my apple cider vinegar. Always shake it up. Don't just let it sit because all the good stuff is at the bottom. So two tablespoons, no, four tablespoons for me because this is so big. And the zeal is going to give it the taste. I'm looking for the sweetness. I'm looking for without all the added sugar. <clears throat> Excuse me. The shake. Oh, and something else I like to put in my, um, when I do my apple cider vinegar. I like to put the collagen powder in. Now, people don't. It's your preference. It's your choice. This is my choice. This is my drink. Put that in here. And I love my flaxseed, so I'm going in with just one tablespoon of flaxseed. <clears throat> flaxseed or either chia seeds, but flaxseeds. Shake this up. Finish filling it off. Just that quick, simple, and easy. And you can also, for me, I like to use my detox seeds whenever I can use them because I keep this stuff on hand. Water. You can use water. <coughs> this is my detox tea right here. I just keep filling this up, but I make sure I have plenty of this on hand. So, as you can see, I got what, a little over a gallon? I ain't playing about my stuff. So, hopefully, everybody is doing their vinegar, their apple cider vinegar. Even if you're not doing the seven day apple cider vinegar detox, you should still be drinking 
apple cider vinegar on a daily basis. You really should. Because it's good for you. So, so good for you. Keeps your body alkaline. It does, has a lot of health benefits. Google it. See what they are. See what you're missing out on. You don't have to spend a lot of money. But I did a video on this a few days ago. So, check it out, people. Check it out. And I also have a detox. I also have a video on my detox teas and detox waters. So let's see what this tastes like. This might not even be good. <laughs> We're going to find out. It's good. It's not overly sweet. The, vin the vinegar, this, the vinegar, and the zeal, it's cool. This is good. This is good for me. So if you haven't started, get started with your apple cider vinegar. And now I'm going to go straight into today's smoothie. And I'll be right back. As you guys know, I'm a big fan of J.J. Smith and her smoothies are the truth. And so I'm going to make me one of them smooth truthies. Okay. Did I say truthy? <laughs> one of them truth smoothies okay and today i'm gonna make the blueberry apple <laughs> smoothie <laughs> oh my goodness i can't believe me sometimes okay i'm just checking making sure everything looks okay <laughs> now this recipe calls for spinach water apples blueberries stevia flax seeds and protein powder is optional i don't use the stevia because it's sweet enough with the fruit. The fruit is already gives it what I need. So I don't use that. So, and I always start off with, okay, it calls for one and a half cups of water. Even if it calls for two cups, I use a little less because sometimes you don't need all that water. And if you don't have you a good mixer, blender, get you a Vitamix. I know a lot of y'all got the ninjas and the oysters and those other ones this one is the truth every blender I just named I have those blenders and I ended up getting this so for me it was wasted money when I could have just got the, the best in the beginning so what I have here is three cups of spinach What I like to do is to get it started, get the spinach, blend it down. If this is too loud for you, mute your microphone. Okay, just that quick. It's my spinach. Okay, I have my collagen powder. So I'm using this brand right here and my flax seeds already measured out this is going in if you don't have the book you need to get the book everybody needs to have this book if you're going to do the uh, <clears throat> her 30 day program or just do her smoothies period because her smoothies are bomb I like ginger in my smoothies so I'm going to put a teaspoon of ginger in my smoothies you make it how you like it even though it doesn't call for it this is how I like it, so this is how I make it. <clears throat> Two cups of blueberries. Two chopped apples. I'm gonna get this going. I love this blender. My sister has one. One of my good girlfriends have one. They try to talk me into it. Oh, no, I'm going to get the Ninja. It's only $50. I'm going to get this. I'm going to get that. I'm good. <laughs> Another thing I like to add, not all the time, but I like to go with the uh, organic greens and fruits for my smoothies. This just gives it that extra whatever. <laughs> Mm. 
So I'll put, I'm just going to use a half of a scoop of this. And I'm going in with my protein powder because I always use protein powder. And it's really good to use a plant-based protein powder. And I'll just do one scoop. This is almost empty. That's a half a scoop, so i got to get another scoop out of here. So it's time to reorder. I also love this stuff in chocolate. This stuff is so good. So, so good. So I got that done. That's what we have. Oh, well, I don't see it, so I got to use it. Oh, there it is. I'm always looking for something. And another reason I don't like to use the full amount of um, water for the recipe is because I like to use ice. So I'll add some ice to this. So by this been the 30 day, for the 30 day smoothie, we're looking at, um, I'm going to say this is going to be two nice size smoothies. Because we're going to have a dinner towards the end. I'm going to be right back with this one because I know you guys are going to hear all that crunching. The smoothie is ready. It's not that super, super milkshakey thing that I would have liked to have had. I could have had that had I not used so much water. So if you want your smoothies really frothy, like a kind of like more of a milkshake consistency, use less water. If it calls for one and a half cups, use three fourths. If it calls for two cups, use one cup. Start off with that. And then by the time you get all your ingredients in, finish it off with ice and you're going to get that real, real good smoothie uh, milkshake taste um, consistency. But you have to have a good blender in order to do that. The Ninja will give you that, what you're looking for. This is my smoothie. I put it in my beautiful Lolita glass, which I love so well. And this is it. This is it. With J.J. Smith's Smoothies, 30-day smoothie challenge, smoothies for life. I love my smoothies. Whenever I need something, I go something to go to. Like I may have eaten dinner or I may have had something, but I just want something else. I always <clears throat> come back to a smoothie because you never go wrong with the smoothies. And she has 30 days worth of smoothies in this book. You have to, you, you really need to purchase this book if you want to do this program. And they sell the book Amazon. Walmart, Target, eBay, and probably Costco. Not sure, but get her book. Get, get J.J. Smith 30 Day Green Smoothies for Life book. This book is the truth. This is my smoothie Bible. I call this my smoothie Bible because I believe in J.J. Smith. You know, she got it going on, and I'm trying to get it going on, and I'm trying to help the rest of you get it going on. Again, that's my time. This is Renee with Eating with Food for Thought Roberts. <clears throat> excuse me, a.k.a. the personal chef. I'm also the administrator of J.J. Smith 30-Day Green Smoothies for Life Challenge on Facebook. If you are not a member of our group, please come by and join our family. If you have not subscribed to my channel on YouTube, Eating with Food for Thought, please stop by and subscribe. Hit the like button. Give me a thumbs up. Hit the notification bell so that you can see more content. I will be doing more smoothies. I will be doing, when well, you see how I did my um, apple cider vinegar drink. So I'm drinking that and I'm, you know, doing the smoothies. And I have other videos too. I do food videos. So stop on by, check me out. And thank you guys for taking the time out to listen and watch. Now, it's 2020, 2019 is over problems we had in 2019, we still got them today 
Ain't nothing changed but the date and the time. You still got the problems. If you're overweight, if you're not the weight you want to be in 20, at the end of 2019, you're still not where you want to be in 2020 as of yet. But we're going to help you get there. Okay? So get your book. Make sure you get your apple cider vinegar book, the seven-day apple cider vinegar book by J.J. Smith, the 30 Days Green Smoothie Challenge. And if you don't have the 10-day book for her smoothies, and she has some really, really good smoothies in the 10-day, get that one too. But get on your smoothie game and get on your apple cider vinegar game. And that's my time. And thank you again.